Hello everybody, it's me, Casper, and today I'm going to be showing you how you could get pretty much any mod you want into Gorilla Tag. So, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go down in the description and download this folder right here. It's called Mod Bypass. Now when you open it, it's not anything suspicious, it's just all the necessary files you're gonna need to get mods working on Gorilla Tag. Now, you can close out of this for now because you'll need this later. Next thing you need to do is download Monkey Mod Manager. Um, once again, I'll leave a download for this in the description. Once again, another very important part for Gorilla Tag mods to work. So, first thing you're going to do when you get everything in is you're going to open up your Monkey Mod Manager, go to Utilities up here, and then click Game Folder. So this will open up your Game Folder. Now, let me just close this because we'll need this later. So, go into Game Folder, go to Google Tag Data, and then go to Managed. So once you're in here, boom, you'll have all of these. Now, what you're going to do is open up your mod bypass folder and press control A on your keyboard to select everything and then press control C to copy it. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go back to your managed folder once again to control A and then paste. And if you see this, just click replace the files in the destination. And boom. You have successfully uh, modded your Gorilla Tag. And once you're done with that, you can just close out of this. Now, you're not done. No, not at all. You're not done at all. So the next thing you're going to want to do is open up Monkey Mod Manager. Yes. And here is a list of mods that sh you might want, but the ones that you absolutely need is Bep Inject, Computer Interface, we don't need Computer Interface, I just prefer it, N Newton Soft, TPM loader, loader, and Utila. Now once you're done with that, you can do whatever other mods you want, like I prefer to do like all of these, the Haunted Mod Menu. A monkey map. Awesome. If you want to do custom maps, do monkey map loader. It's definitely worth it. And then just click install slash update. While waiting for this to finish installing, make sure you guys click the subscribe button down below and hit the like while you're at it. Because my goal is to get to 100 subscribers by the end of the year. And I think we can do it. So once you see this down here, the install complete, um, you, you pretty much have everything set up for mods. But... If you open up Gorilla Tag, there's not going to be any mods yet. So, what you could do is you could go to Chrome and you could find, like, some mods. Like, I like the Bark Mod menu. Um, you know. So, see, it shows a tutorial on how to do it right here. I'll show you how to do this in a second. Alright, so what you could do is you could just, like, download your mod menu. And as you can see, it's installing right here. And if it says this, trust it. It's it it's not gonna harm your computer. It's a it, the only reason why your computer says this is because it's a .dll file and there are scripts in it. Click keep and you'll be all set. Now, this guy on screen right now asked me how do I get the Gorilla Tagging Kid mod menu. I would not recommend it because um, it basically has auto report, which if you're using it, it'll just automatically report you and you'll get banned incredibly fast. So, I'm not going to show you how to um, get that menu, but I'm, I am going to show you how to get Bark. So, I'll leave this link in the description down below. Go check it out. So, once you have your menu downloaded, um, what you can do is you can open up your Monkey Mod Manager, go back to Utilities, and click X Folder, which will open up this. This is what you just installed, Bepinex, alright? And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to plugins, 
and boom here are all the mods that you downloaded so you have all of these and as you can see here is easy camera mod I'll also leave this in the description down below now what you could do is you could take this you could click show in folder and what you could do is you can just drag it over like this Oop. and you moved it over to your plugins it's really simple it's not that hard and yeah so yeah that is how you get mods in gorilla tag so thank you guys for watching comment like and subscribe and i'll see you all in the next one bye bye